Hello everyone, welcome to episode 32 of uh, Talking Business with Ritz. This is Ritzel Loredo Rectra, a digital process automation specialist and content creator. I am the owner, founder, and CEO of Mighty Chill Virtual Solutions. I have been in the online business for uh, since 2018, and I am a system consultant by trade. And I've been in the IT industry for almost 30 years. All right, moving on. I encountered a problem that is commonly faced by coaches, course creators, and fellow service providers. And what is this problem? A decline in revenue because of poor client retention. Today, I'll be giving you a glimpse of the solution that I will be sharing in my bootcamp this October. Hi, Facebook user. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. You love the trailer. Okay, thank you very much. All right. So today I'll be giving you a glimpse of the solution that I will be sharing in my bootcamp this October 10 to 14. The goal of this mini masterclass is for you, you coaches, course creators, and service providers to understand the three secrets to designing a streamlined, automated onboarding system that will help you get new customers and grow your business without the overwhelm and the burnout. So the best to improve client retention and revenue is to make onboarding a simple process for new clients. By making onboarding easy, you can eliminate a lot of friction for clients who are trying to get started. It's also a great way to build relationships with your client and keep them coming back. All right. Let's see. Oh, Jeff. <laughs> Hi, Jeff. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. You're here. Okay. Uh, here is our agenda for today. Let me share my screen. At the stream. Right, Jeff is watching us live from pizza shop. Enjoy your pizza. Okay. Um, do let me know if you can see the screen, though. Let me uh, help me with the, uh, help me with it and see whether you know. Comment comment if you can see it clearly. All right. So, um, welcome to the mini masterclass. Uh, it's about streamlined automated onboarding system. Okay, and our agenda for today. Ta -da! The intro to automated onboarding system. Secret number one. Secret number two, we will be tackling them. Okay, one by one. Secret number three, and then my invitation at the end to follow me on YouTube. Uh, username or channel is Rizzle Rectra and sign up for the free bootcamp. All right. So I receive a lot of feedback about how easy my process is for my guests since I started my live expert interview series. The only thing they have to do uh, is actually to show up and be assured that the interview is well thought, is well thought out and delivered as per agreement, as per the agreement. So my my own client onboarding system was put in place as a service provider. So they sign up for, you know, uh, my virtual card to make sure I am paid upfront as well. So I also put that one for my own business. 
So it doesn't require contracts or invoice. I send a welcome email which serves as agreement, as the agreement document between me and my client. So every time the status of the task is updated, clients are automatically emailed, which is included in this process. So a weekly email is sent to the client notifying them of how much balance they have in their virtual debit card and reminding them to top up. So my clients know that their money is being put to good use. They are not left in the dark about what is happening with their investment, all right? And uh, the stress is removed from their day-to-day -day business. So because of this, I was commissioned by Marjorie Torrey to design and build an automated system for her launch program. Okay? So let's go to now to the streamlined automated onboarding system was born using the ISDA framework. Okay, I'll be talking about the ISDA frame, framework at the end. All right, now let's go to the first agenda, which is the intro to the streamlined onboarding. Okay, so for my intro, I just talked about the backstory, okay? Earlier, so it says that I started my live expert interview series, so I got lots of feedback of how smooth and easy my process is for my guests. And also as a service provider, this is just a summary, I also had put in place my own client onboarding system. So because of this, I, I got commissioned by Coach Marjorie Torre to design and build her automated onboarding system for her launch program using Kajabi. I'll be showing you the 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 onboarding system that I've uh, created for her at, at the end. So this is such a common problem and a big time waste for coaches and coach creators to do. So I found a problem, so I created a solution. That's when the streamlined automated onboarding system was born. So why, why streamlined automated onboarding system? Why S-A-O-S? All right. So why? It is important for us, all right, it is important for us to have a smooth client introduction to make sure that we retain clients. The more loyal the clients are, the more business is going to come your way. So the more business means more money in the bank. So I don't want to scare you or anything, but I want to be very clear with you all. So your current onboarding process is one of the biggest time wasters, okay, in your business. If it is not streamlined, let me fix this so you all can see it, okay, nicely on the screen. All right. So, um. Right, so your current onboarding process is one of the biggest time wasters in your business if it is not streamlined. So you may have already encountered this problem, but this problem keeps many people from getting the right training they need to succeed. So have you ever been in a situation where you purchase a course, but you don't know where you can get it or you can get to or where to log in? When is the first meeting supposed to happen? Well, I did, and I feel used and neglected. So it's like they just took my money, all right? Most of the reasons why streamlined automated onboarding system is beneficial for your business are as follows, okay? If you want to sell high tickets, make your client feel high ticket too, all right? Make them feel VIP right let the tech work for you okay there are so many tools that you can use according to your budget and according to the purpose that you want that you need your business need now free up a lot of brain space and save time guide them on how they can consume what they bought and improves client retention when client retention is improved it also increases revenue 
or profit for your business. Okay, so that's that about our intro. Now let's jump to process. This is secret number one, process. Okay, identifying the steps. Identifying the steps. Okay, where is my notes? There you go. That you need to automate the client onboarding process. All right. Is the first step to automation. You will be able to create a plan for automating each of those steps once you have identified them. So let's first define what a process is. So a business process is a sequence of steps, sequence of steps that a business follows to deliver products or services. So it's meant to accomplish big goals. Okay. So according to processmodel.com, a process is a series of steps and decisions involved in the way work is completed. We may not realize it, but processes are everywhere and in every aspect of our work and leisure. Now, processes naturally develop as part of the business of getting work done. Like, for example, the marketing department wants to increase, right? Or improve their return on their investment. So their process will involve a lot of things such as budgeting, market research, and creating a new ad campaign. They will look at its success to see if they succeeded in achieving their goals. So to summarize, process is what? A sequence of tasks and activities aimed at accomplishing big goals like increase your ROI and have cause and effect in order to deliver an output. All right? It's either an external or internal output. External means you produce the product, okay, or you provide products and services to customers. Internal means to arrive at the decision. What are these decisions? Hire a new member, acquire new tools, create a new product, reinvoice a client, and so on. All right. So what are these examples, aside from what I mentioned earlier about the marketing department? Samples are which is uh, most relevant to us, invoicing and billing, cost estimating and cost approval, team member recruitment, okay, client retention and market campaign, marketing campaign. So if you noticed, I highlighted client retention. This is our target and this is the problem, the mini problem that we're trying to resolve, okay? More examples. Okay, according to process models, this is the examples in real life. Okay, like for example, no, preparing breakfast. There's a process to it. Placing an order, another process. Developing a budget, another process. And triaging a, a patient. This is also another example of processes. So I hope you understand what a process means. Okay, because this is very crucial in designing your automated onboarding system okay now as a coach uh, as a coach course creator or service provider we must identify and document these processes that we have in our business once that is done we can now group them by category or workflow which leads us to secret number two okay secret number two Workflow. A workflow is a system for managing repetitive, okay, a system for managing repetitive processes and tasks which occur in a particular order is what IBM defines as a workflow. So whether manufacturing a product, providing a service, processing information, or any other value-generating activity, they are the mechanism by which people and enterprises accomplishes their work. So a business can eliminate or speed up time consuming and, you know, and inefficient processes with the help of workflow automation. So talking about workflow, 
This is how we summarize. Again, workflow. Let me change the setup so you can see clearly. So our workflow is sets of procedures or steps that can be followed by team members, okay? A workflow is good. You know, it should work if everything is good and if something goes wrong. That's the best thing. It's a con contingency procedures. Okay. Now, a workflow, an established workflow should work in chaotic environment. Like, like what I said, when something goes wrong. Okay. It is ideal when the work itself is predictable. All right. So examples of or let's let's talk about the three elements of a workflow okay a workflow has three elements which is input transformation and output input it has to have a trigger okay and then in in that trigger in the workflow has to have a transformation what happens right and then the output okay what is the result of this transformation so that is the three elements. Now, if we talk about the examples of a workflow, workflow automation, which is our um, target, invoicing is a workflow. Customer support is a workflow. Task management, lead generation and management, data collection, and client onboarding. This is what we are trying to solve. Okay? So that's secret number two which I hope you understand. If you have questions, type it in the comment. Okay, now let's jump to secret number three. Secret number three. Oh, it says here that, com that companies can save up 30% 30, 30 more time if they automate tasks like gathering data, storing process documents according to... Two-thirds of workers, automation improves their productivity and time management. So imagine how much time you could save on your business. Now, let's talk about secret number three, which is tools. Let's jump to tools. Okay. So we know that workflow, automation can't be done if we don't have the right tools. Depending on the purpose and your budget, you will be able to match which tools to use in each workflows for your onboarding system or process. So here are some of the well-known tools that I had tried and tested. So the tools I use for my business are highlighted in green. Okay, let me just go through each and every, every uh, type of tools, okay? Like, for example, the client booking schedule. There are Google Calendar schedule ones. Outlook calendar and many more. Those that are in green is, are the ones that I've been I am using in my business. Okay, that's the calendar booking. Course area management. We got Kajabi, Member Vault, and many more. And we got Group Launch, which is the white label GHL. Another one is the email sequence. Okay. If you notice that Kajabi and Group High Level or um, uh, Group Launch or Go High Level are mentioned in uh, one or uh, more most of the tool category that means they are uh, one of the features of they they are part of the features of the tools okay so we got mailchimp kajabi gmail uh, ghl and many more okay crm customer relations ship man management also the same kajabi google sheet airtable and ghl okay video conferencing zoom the famous one, StreamYard, and many others like StreamIO, <laughs> the one that we used with Larry last time. Okay, next would be the social post scheduler. So these are the native scheduler for Facebook group, uh, Genius Post Scheduler, Buffer, Postly, Later, and Meta Business Suite, and so many more. Okay, creatives, I will um, jump. We'll skip this one for now. So creatives, we got Canva, Crello, iMovie, Photoshop, and others. Okay. For funnels and pages, um, you know, Kajabi, ClickFunnels, WordPress, Wix, uh, GHL, and others. Okay. Messenger, how do you communicate 
with your clients. So um, how do you uh, inform your clients at a timely manner? Many chat, GHL, social bot, genius messenger, CRM. Uh, there are slacks, uh, click up also got, all right? So that's the messenger. And the most important tool that you should have are the connectors, okay? This part, this is the most important um, tools that you should have when you are automating processes and workflows. Zapier, Publi, Integromat, Integrately, IFFT, and so many others. Okay, so those are the tools. All right, now we're jumping to my invitation to you. So here's my invitation to you. My invitation to you is to join me, okay, in the Streamline Automated Onboarding Bootcamp this coming October 10 uh, to, to 14, okay, at 11 a.m. EST. All right. Again, L October 10 to 14 at 11 a.m. EST. This is a free bootcamp where we will be doing, okay, where um, in the upcoming bootcamp, the promise is to help you design an automated high-ticket client onboarding system fit to your business model. Okay, so the link is shown on the screen here. All right, www.mightychillvirtualsolutions.com slash saob dash opt-in. Okay. And also on day five of the bootcamp, we will put together the processes and workflows that your business requires, and we will match it with the right tools and that fits the purpose and your budget. So let me open it, this one. So we will also be um, discussing about the... ISDA framework in the bootcamp, okay, that I used. This is what I used, okay, to design and build my uh, automated onboarding. All right, uh, identify where we identify the processes and workflows, okay. We select the tools of the trade. We design the client onboarding needs, okay? And then we build and implement client onboarding. Now in the bootcamp, we will stop at the designing, all right? Because this is where we need to focus more, um, more time, okay? If the design is wrong, then building and implementing would be a waste of time. So because you're just going to go around and go back to the drawing board again. So that is not streamlined. Okay. So I am inviting you to join the wagon as early as now. So the link again is on the screen or message me and I will give you the link directly. Also, I just created a YouTube channel. A YouTube channel where I will upload the latest episode of my weekly live expert interview called uh, Talking Business with Ritz. So you follow me on YouTube and here is, right, here is my channel, okay? Um, and also, I'll be gamifying the bootcamp and we'll be giving away a one-on-one -on -one strategy session worth $500 and uh, free access to an automation tool worth $37 per month. So see you on the bootcamp this October 10 to 14. Now, I'm not going to put up the, do we have, okay, I don't see any questions on the comments, but if you are watching, uh, going to watch this on a replay, right, type your comments or type your questions in the comments. So again, this is uh, episode 31. Let me run my sign up, okay? Let me run this one. Okay. And then here is, again, 
the sign up URL. Okay. So again, um, this is uh, episode 32 of Talking Business with Ritz. Let me remove this on. Yes, there you go. Remember to watch the replay either on my profile, on my business page, or where else? My YouTube channel <laughs> that I just created. So the replay is always pinned at my at the top of my Facebook profile post. So, so yeah. So let's see if somebody will watch this on replay or if somebody is watching it live today. I'm giving away a, a free access to someone who will type the magic word pitbull again. Type the magic word pitbull. So the first one who comments wins the free access. I'm going to give you something that is worth your while. So for those catching up on replay, comment hashtag replay and leave your questions. I hope you've learned what are the three secrets of designing an automated onboarding system, what is a process, a workflow, and the difference between the two. Now, how important it is to have a smooth client onboarding system and why it is necessary to automate the process. I hope you've learned that to have this in place, it should not be complicated, but instead it should be efficient enough to fit the purpose and your budget. So for those who came in late, please watch the replay, comment the magic word, pitbull, all right? And I'm going to give you a free access to an automation tool that you're going to love. All right, ladies and gentlemen, join the Streamlined Automated Onboarding Bootcamp this coming October 10 to 14. Now, the bootcamp is free of this in this iteration so I can validate the solution. What I require for the attendees is to attend, do the work, provide the feedback, and give testimonials. So the opt-in page is display on the screen. Again, do make sure to DM me if you're interested. Thank you all for watching. Stay tuned next week for another episode of Talking Business with Ritz, where we share the value bombs to help you get a small win or move your needle or your business even just a little bit. I'm going to have a guest next week. Um, please do remember that every first Saturday, I'm, I'm going to do uh, the show by myself so I can, you know, practice and share what I learn as well. I can practice sharing what I learn or teach what I learn. So anyway, so we will be interviewing experts to share their expertise with us. We'll be giving tips and tricks about content creation or social media management. We will be sharing and trying out automation tools that can be done by Nantechi, which will help you save time. We will be sharing insights and being a program mom without the scarcity mindset for which I am teaching myself too and many more. Again, I'll be validating a solution to a problem in relation to client retention this coming October through a five-day boot camp. Sign up for free. All right. Thank you very much for watching. See you next week for another episode of Talking Business with Ritz. So this is Ritzel Loredo Rector, your digital process automation specialist. Stay safe and healthy. See you next time.